I'm going to stay in the commentary box then for the Close Brothers Novices Handicap Chase of a two and a half miles at the top. We've got Lanelli Sultan for Thomas Rogers Market Tavern or Graham Close Brothers Monique Lulier Martin Lidham Northern Life Kevin Mead Hand Glory B Drama David Robertson Top Shelf Craig Beckwith October Cat Graham Close Brothers Heathcote Monarch Thomas Rogers Magic Girl David Hooley Motley Stu Gray and James Shaves this year's King of the Hunter is at the bottom he's got the bottom two Troll Evelyn and Ennery Crime so a dozen of them then and away they go and the novice handicap hurdle Heathcote Monarch the first to show and as they get to the first hours are four already Monique Lulier has gone so not a particularly good race for me as that's mine out as they get to the second and over that one they go and a bit of a dive at that from top shelf at the back as well that one nearly departed the race early as well but it's Heathcote Monarch then who's in the lead from Lanelli Sultane in second as they come to the third and over that one they go and the mistake this time was by Trouble Evelyn so there's one or two already made some mistakes and I wouldn't be at all surprised if we don't see a few more casualties in this race the way they've started so far I mean jump three and we've already lost one and there have been at least two or three major mistakes as well but Heathcote Monarch has gone off into that customary four or five length lead that someone always seems to get these days. Lanelli Sultane is second, then October Cat is in third. Gap of two lengths, then back to Trouble Evening and Mutley with Ennery Crime as they get over number four. And indeed, there's another one gone there. It's Trouble Evening that's gone this time. So that's the second one out of the race as they get to the fifth. And over that one they go. And this time, the mistake was by Magic Girl at the back for David Hooley. But Heathcote Monarch is clear. Oh, stable mate Lanelli Sultane. October Cat is in third, then Henry Crime is in fourth with Market Tavern and Northern Life, and then Motley after that one with Top Shelf and finally Magic Girl. And they're the only ones left. Only 12 that started as they get over number six. And all we'll safely over that one. And this will be the last next time round. Over it they go. And all safely over it. Oh, they swing out left-handed and Heathcote Monarch is probably 8 to 10 clear now of Lanelli Sultane in second, Glory B Drama is in third and then Henry Crime is in fourth October Cat on the inside is in fifth with Northern Life and Market Tavern after that then Mutley and Top Shelf as they get over number 8 and they race away down towards the back straight where the water jump will be coming up fairly soon it's Heathcote Monarch in the lead Heathcote Monarch from Lanelli Sultane and Glory B Drama then comes Henry Crime and Northern Life as they make their way to the next plane one and over that one they go the water will be next up with Heathcote Monarch's lead now cut in half really going to just no more than about five from the Lily Sultan in second Glory B Drama is in third then Henry Crime is in fourth as they get over the water with Northern Life Market Tavern going well also Motley running a big race on the outside there and uh, Top Shelf is trying to get back into it as well after that early mistake but over the ditch they go and all safely over that one with Heathcote Monarch still clear in front the lead fluctuating between 5, 6 to 10 lengths but it's about 6 again now as they get over that one with Lanelli Sultan in second Glory B Drama looks to be going well in third also Northern Life sitting quietly on that one but he's going to need a bit of a split then comes Motley and Magic Girls trying to get going as well the back 3 Magic Girl top shelf and October Cat are not out of it as they come to the next ditch and all safely over that one though. A bit of a sticky jump by Market Tavern. I've seen that lose a couple of places. And it's Heathcote Monarch. Heathcote Monarch in the lead. Only by about three or four then now. Two Lanelli Sultan in second. Northern Life has crept through into third. Then comes Henry Crime. Motley going well on the outside. Then comes Glory B Drama. Magic Girl and Market Tavern are next. Then Top Shelf October cuts the back marker. They're coming down towards the third from home in now. And Heathcote Monarch gets over it in the lead. Mistake by Motley just as he was making a move. Henry Crime moves into second. Northern Life is third. Top Shelf is now looking a big danger. But it's still Heathcote Monarch. They haven't got to him yet. He's been in the lead all the way. He's got two more fences to take and three more furlongs to race. But it's Heathcote Monarch in the lead from Top Shelf in second. Henry Crime is now third. Northern Life on the inside is fourth. Motley started to beat the retreat. Market Tavern's coming round the outside with Magic Girl. 
as they race down towards the final two and top shelf hits the front. Heathcote Monarch surrenders the lead for the first time, makes a mistake as well. Here comes Northern Life and Henry Crime on the outside market. Savile and Magic Girl up the final fence and top shelf jumps it well and gets away from it well. Northern Life is trying to close it, still a fur on the go and it's top shelf in front. Top shelf by two, Northern Life is trying to get closer, so too is Magic Tavern but it's my top shelf on Northern Life. Top shelf in the lead, Northern Life is lunging on the outside and Northern Life has got to steal it. Northern Life wins his market tavern second. Top shelf was back in third and all the way back to Lanelli Sultan and Market Tavern looked to be going well throughout the race but it didn't look like it was going to have the speed to get up and win. There's a stewards inquiry though so hold on to those tickets and Northern Life keeps it. Northern Life the winner for Kevin Meenahan. So a great return for Kevin Meenahan back in the window with a stable and he's taken a Cheltenham winner on day one. Top shelf second for Craig Beckwith who was unlucky. Market Tavern third for Graham Clutterbuck. Heathcote Monarch long time leader for da Thomas Rogers was fourth. Uh, Magic Girl for David Hooley was fifth. Uh, I think I'm going to hand you over to Stu and he'll take you through race eight.